when we think in terms of the core principles of the curriculum design for our programs, and we have undergraduate, we have got master's program, we have a PhD program. Especially for the undergraduate and the masters, we clearly make sure that leadership is a big part of it. Win-win we proposition, thinking end-to-end, -end, straddling between the forests and trees to make sure that they not only strategize but execute. Then there is this, you know, we, we want them to be also grounded in things like analytics. You know, analytics as it applies to supply chain, making decisions that are evidence-based. Then we care about things like global orientation, that they have a global outlook, that whether it's at the undergraduate or the graduate level, they get to understand the realities of global markets, the challenges of catering to even things like underserved community in underdeveloped countries. So this idea of reliability, responsiveness, resilient, and responsible supply chains is another piece that we'd like to embed. So these are like topical issues that are covered in our curriculum in the classroom by through by courses. Then we also provide students opportunities to go out and work in the community, working on some experiential learning projects. Being where we are, I think it makes this all very feasible and sustainable because Twin Cities is really a hub of the medical device and the health sector, which truly a a supply chain connecting the development of care with the delivery of care. You know, we are also the hub of a global food and agribusiness sector. So we go from farm to fork and we can see all those issues. Similarly, we are a major hub for the retail sector. We can see how orders are taken, how the orders are processed, how the orders are fulfilled. And then we are also part of a global manufacturing industry so we have the 3Ms, the Donaldsons, the Polarises. And therefore, because of this presence of the sectors, it ensures that the work that we do by way of either research and teaching is firmly grounded in some of these rather very global, growing, and evergreen sectors. So we are truly blessed to have this community around us and, and we have been trying to leverage and as well this community and also contribute back to this community.